What is good, y'all? SUG family. It's your boy Smooth Guy Game back with yet another series idea that I'm having. If you guys show the love and support, we will bring it back and have more of it on the channel. Uh, but this is a new series that I wanted to do with Madden. Uh, you know, we've just completed the Lions rebuild, at least as far as like, you know, we got a Super Bowl. So now we're going to keep defending and keep playing it out to the New Year comes around, but just wanted to test some stuff out before we get to the next man. And an idea I had, you can tell by the title, is bringing back old favorites. Didn't get a really good, you know, didn't have the career that we probably thought they would have. Some big names that whether it was injuries, uh, storylines, you know, outside field affection you know, sometimes coming into play that didn't really have the type of careers that we thought they might have. So I'm gonna re put them back into a draft, see where they go, and player lock them as we go to get through the series. And I got it in scouting mode here. You know, I just started out with the Saints, one of my favorite team. And I went and put in, you can tell by the title, I already know, but just for dramatic effect, Marcus Lattimore. We went ahead and put him into the game at some of the similar stuff that I found. I went, went to South Carolina, right-handed, 22 years old at the top, or at this point, 22 years old, 221, weight, 5'11". Uh, and I went, all I did basically is I took his old combine numbers. I looked up Madden's like uh, reference sheet for, okay, if they did, I like, had this 40, this is what their speed would be. And I put it into the system. So he's got beastman move, a trucking right now, based on all the, you know, the notes that they put in from his combine and his natural numbers. But you can see some of the stuff here, great to elite strength, poor to marginal speed, great to elite jumping, decent solid change of direction, poor to marginal agility, poor to marginal acceleration. Hey, those were those were the notes by the, the scouting professionals, not me. So if you guys want to see more of this series and you want to see how it goes, leave a like and comment down below. Also, when you're commenting, let me know what you guys would want to see from the series. My idea is just to play through his rookie season and do a 10 year sim and see what happens after about 10 years and see where his career kind of goes, see what team he ends up on, see how the longevity of the career goes. Um, and basically give the man the career that he probably should have had. I mean, he was a high, at least in my mind, I think there was a lot of hype surrounding him. I know he had the two ACLs and then decided to go into the draft without playing again after an ACL surgery. But I was really rooting for dude to actually have a decent career when he got drafted by the 49ers. Maybe you guys are the same way. Maybe some of you guys are 49er fans and you guys felt bad too as well. You wanted him to play good. So let's see what kind of it turns out too. So what we'll be doing is I'm going, I have everything set to auto. I had to turn the scouting on manual so I can do that. I'm about to turn that back to auto. We're going to simulate to the end of the season, see who wins the Super Bowl and see who picks him up. And we'll get into game one of the year. Uh, maybe run through the preseason too as well. Well, no, nah, we'll, we'll skip the preseason. Y'all ever trying to see the preseason? Preseason and the whole uh, first full full game? Maybe. And here it is. So the Saints didn't, go, look at all that cast space we got though. We went 12 and five. Did not end up making the Super Bowl with the third seed. Lost to the Buccaneers, unfortunately. And they actually went on to beat the Packers and then get beat by the Eagles, who were the two seed after beating the Cowboys. Cardinals beat the Panthers, got beat by the Eagles. So now it's the Eagles and Ravens in the Super Bowl. Ravens beat the Chiefs. Before that, they beat the Dolphins, who happened to upset the Titans. Chiefs beat the Colts. Bills beat the Broncos. Chiefs beat the Bills. And Ravens has the one seed. Eagles has the two seed. Y'all think that could happen in the Super Bowl in real life? Put comments and predictions down below what you guys think would happen in real life in the Super Bowl. My prediction right now, Hopefully this doesn't age well, because I know this isn't coming out until next week, so the first round, walk around will be done. My prediction is honestly the 49ers versus the uh, Bengals. That is who I think will be going to the Super Bowl, and I think the Bengals will come out on top this time. Uh, let me know what you guys think. You know how you guys think. Final four, Bengals. I got to rerun through the playoff scenarios in my head. I think I had Bengals, Chiefs, 49ers, Eagles. I know I had 49ers, Eagles for sure, but I can't remember if I had Bengals, Bills, or Bengals, Chiefs. I think it was Bengals, Chiefs. All right, so we're in the off season. Everything is auto at this point, so they will be doing that. Like we're all the way to the draft. I don't think I have to do the draft. I think I can simulate the draft. It'd be great to see if he if, where he ends up getting taken. Let's let's go and pin to it. Let's see if we can see where he gets taken. I don't know if it'll be like a first. Let's see, I go to make selection. Oh wow, we're already at our pick at twenty four. Never mind. I thought I'd get to see everybody's everybody's pick. It, it says I put it on auto and simple. It's getting me all the way up here. Is he even taking it already though? Nope, he's still here. He's a day three uh, considered, so I can see that. Let's skip ahead to the next user pick. This will at least help us with um, knowing 
where to look when we go look and see what team he's taking by. Let's see. Pick player. Halfback. Oh, there he is. He'll probably be taken soon. He's number three on the halfback list right now, so we'll probably see him go at the beginning of day four. Skip to next user pick. So fourth round. So now we know to look in between late third, early first, or early fourth. Yep, he's been taken. There it is. Marcus Lattel drafted pretty close to where he was in real life. That's what I wanted to say on simulate. I know he went fourth. I think it's actually fourth, fourth round, 24th pick. But he still went in the fourth round like he did in real life. I got pretty close to making him go to where he was supposed to. So now we can go ahead and skip to the end of the draft. Let's see what team we will be playing on. So like I said, we will be playing through his rookie season, through the 10-year sim. Unless, of course, you guys want to see me just keep playing. After that, we'll play as many seasons as you want. If you want to play until he gets a Super Bowl ring or whatnot, you know, we can. Uh, but we will be player locking on him here in a second. Let's go look at the draft recap. Let's see what the Saints did in this draft. Right in, Jose Johnson, tight end, DC, halfback Anthony Jackson. They should have took up Marcus Lattimore, Lionel Nelson, and Amber English. Not too bad. I mean, 270s, not, not all that bad, but we'll go round three. Get it fell. And we know it would be on the back half, so let me sort this way. Okay, so he went fourth round. Good to know. Boom. So fourth round, let's see where he went. There he is. Wow, that's tough. I feel like I should automatically trade my dude. The Giants definitely have Saquon Barkley. Why did they go with the running back? I don't know. 75 overall, 73 awareness, 84 speed. So this is kind of your first look at some of his attributes. He does have in depth. Had to give it to him. Uh, 75 uh, power back, 69 elusive, 69, 63 receiving. 88 break tackle, 84 speed, 80 acceleration, 78 agility. And these were the numbers that came out from his stuff that he did at the combine. So look at everything he did at the combine. You can go Google it yourself. And this is what it translates to as far as rating. So catching is good. He was known as a very good receiving back too as well. Injury was probably a little high, but I couldn't, I couldn't do it. So I was not about to give my dude like 50 injury just because of the two ACLs. <laughs> that, that is bittersweet. That is too soon. We was not doing that for him. Uh, but we will. He's got the day one starter tag, uh, which is great. So he will actually you know, kind of take over that role. And we will be going to player lock as him. So I think to do that, unfortunately, to most Saints fans' happiness, we'll have to uh, retire our coach and go ahead and switch up and be a new member. Let's see here. And here he is, man. Rocking 21. Uh, I think that was the most recent number I could see him in too as well. Got the height, weight. I even found a face that fit where he was kind of at. Uh, kind of look, it's the one with like cornrows. That was the last picture that I saw uh, of him actually playing. I tried to get the equipment exactly right. You know, I couldn't, for whatever reason, I couldn't get the socks and stuff right. I couldn't get those leg sleeves to go away. Um, and these were the, the stats that everything translated to. Now, actually, you know, he actually already had like um, a hidden dev trait. I just kind of kept it on there. Uh, I wasn't going to take it away. Uh, plus, you know, this series, they're, they're high value people. They're people that should have better careers. So I think they're deserving of hidden dev. So that's why I didn't take it away. But he's got the first year of the, what's it called? The instant starter tag, whatever it's called. When you first day starter, there it is. First day starter tag. So we'll have to see if he, he actually did get moved up to number one over Saquon. I don't know why they you know, took him in this scenario, but at least we have a two-headed monster. So if I get tired, we got my boy Saquon looking out. So what we'll do is, you know, preseason is pretty quick anyway. We'll just show you know, some of our best runs from preseason and we'll get to a full game. And for this series too, just want to get this out of the way. We'll be using coach suggestions. So it's whatever that is, and we will be player locked on our guy. So straight up running back skills here. Oh my gosh, I ain't going nowhere. <laughs> It's just going to be annoying having to switch to him at all times, making sure that I'm on him. Right here. Uh oh, he's going deep down the field. Does Danny Dom have Doms? Okay. Oh, oh, it's Carson Wentz now. Oh, new quarterback. I wish there was a way to player lock a little bit quicker so that way I could just stay on my running back and not have to switch every two seconds. So that's going to be the only annoying part of the series that might make some of this take a little bit longer. It's just having to constantly switch to my dude, but 
it is what it is. I'm not gonna change anything either, too. What running back you know calling it hot routes and audibles? Get off me! Get off me! There you go. Marcus Lattimore looking strong today. Okay, well, we still let my man pass. I'm not gonna. Whoop. Come here. Yep. Come on now. Good. Good adjustments, Marcus. Latt Marcus Lattimore was a smart player now. So don't get me wrong. Now, it ain't all about me though. As long as the team's getting dubs and wins, we want to try to go to the postseason. So let's get out. Come on. Ooh, that was a good knockdown. He would have been able to get to me too. Well, fourth and four, ain't nothing we can do. Kick it back. All right, first to ten. We will get for like a little bit longer here. Let's go ahead and get that catch. Yeah, my boy got moves now. Oh, whoa. It's just tough when you don't really have speed, so it's not like I can just break away or take any of these long. But we will have you know, opportunities to make these sticks wiggle. Oh, they ain't getting nothing. Ah, uh, yeah, I'm on the outside. Oh. Come on. Oh, no. You should have waited for me. Why'd you throw it so quick, Wentz? Another thing, too. We're running with the actual Giants playbook here. So it's not my Detroit Lions rebuild playbook. So not a whole lot of, like, read offense and stuff like that. But we'll actually get to see what the Giants playbook looks like. I'd like to experiment with some, especially when I'm playing online. Oh, dang, I picked that play way too quick. Right, we're going to block this time. Second and 12. The first run did nothing. Nobody's out anywhere. And... Carson Wentz looking kind of trash. All right, we need to get some, some plays going here. I'm not looking too smooth right now. Let's go a little play fake. I'm right here. There we go. Give me that first. Ooh, shrugged off one. Come on now. That's fine. I'm never going to shy away from my carries now. Look, I'm not even going to change the, the mic read, so I hope Carson Wentz reading the mic. Oh, yeah. We up the middle. Ah. Ah. Ah, I'm too strong. He, he was known for being a tough runner. OBJ, Kenny Galladay, Robinson, Carson Wentz, me out the backfield. Oh, yeah, right here. Come here. Huh. Get off me. There we go. Good you. This game already looking better. I got two catches. The run game looking all right. Let me get over to my dude. Huh. Let's get off the backfield. There we go. Good slide off. Hey, it's all right. We got a first down, though. Let's keep moving. Like I said... This plays to help the team win. It's not always going to be a run by me. There we go. Good. Oh, my gosh, Wentz. That's something else I can't control, the turnovers. Carson Wentz is going to have to make his own mistakes. We're down 7 to 14, first and 10. I'm going to come out here in the flats. Oh, good spin. Good spin. Yes, sir. They said in the, in the combine notes, my dude had good spin abilities. Let's go to read option. I don't think the play action will work here. We haven't really tried to run that much yet. Let's see what he does with this one. Oh, he's going to hand that. Oh, wait. No, he took that. Dang, he tricked me. I thought I, thought I had the rock. We got to keep trying to pass the ball. I mean, we got to get points on the board eventually. We're out. The flat's leaking. Leaking. Oh, yeah. Stay in bounds. Oh, the speed to stay in. Motioning. Here we go up the middle. Oh, yes. Oh, if I had the speed. Y'all can let me know, too, other players that you guys might want to see in this series. I got a pretty good idea who I want to use next time. Defensive players are up for this, too. So if there are defensive players that you guys have in mind, in fact, the next person that I do after this will be a defensive player, which is why I think this series should be kind of, you know, short and simple. You know, a couple episodes, one season, big sim at the end, see how the career went. And, you know, at the end of Madden's Lifestyle, we can go ahead and see who is the best person that I recreated. Not every time I'm going to make it to the Super Bowl. Not every time I'm going to have a fire season. But it could be fun. And defensive players are eligible. I think I can be defensive linemen. So, you know, we'll keep it up for D-line, D O-line. I don't really want to do no O-line. Please don't do that. But uh, please don't do kickers or punters either. Oh, no, I got bumped. All right, second and ten. Gotta make something happen here? Right here. Come on, give me that. Hmm. Took through. Oh, come on now. Let's go hurry up. Good job, QB. Way to call to hurry up. Deep in. I'll block this time. I'll block. I'll block. I'm coming over here for the blitz. Yeah, I stopped him for a little bit. Throw right here. Oh, yeah. Get in that end zone. <laughs> I was coming up to lay a block. I right, was trying to get a touchdown here before the end of our little session here in preseason. Come on. Ah, not much room. I hate their play calling, man. They keep going under center. I want to flip this so bad, but I can't. 
I'm not the QB. Get in. Ah. All right, I need y'all boys to block. Let's get in. Hold them blocks. Hold them blocks. Hold them blocks. First touchdown of Marcus Lattimore's career by, you know, preseason. But there we go. We finally in the crib hole. And here we are. I made a mistake. Apparently, I skipped a game. I don't even know how I did that, but I, I guess I did by accident. Now, the only thing that sucks is I don't get, like, looks like I can't, like, practice or anything to get, like, you know, extra XP. But we can go ahead and set our goals here. So I think a goal should be rushing yards. I want to try to get 1,000. So let's put it at 900 for right now. Commit to this goal. I want to hit 1,000. I don't think I'll, I don't know about 1,100, but I definitely want to hit 1,000. So we'll be going to the new season. Our first opponent here will be the Rams. And I think since I simulated four, we can't even look at like my preseason numbers. Oh, I made big mistakes. It's, uh, it's, all right. it's a learning curve, right? We'll, we'll get through it and we will learn how to better navigate these menus. So unfortunately going into this still a 75 overall, but hopefully I can get some more XP here soon. So that way we can start actually doing some work. So we'll get into the first game of the season. I will see you guys there. The weekly goal is to score one touchdown. So, so I get right. Yes, sir. It's opening day, baby. We finally get to see what this team got here today. Look, ooh, get him. Ah, come on now. You got to throw that ball out. But we get to finally see what our team has, and already it's not looking too good. We do have Carson Wentz as our new QB, but the wide receiver core is pretty straight. We match that up with me in the backfield. I think we got a pretty good chance to do something here. Good break and tackle. There we go. Now third and twenty. We shouldn't see the first running attempt of the uh, of the regular season just yet. I guess that's a new rookie tight end or something. Tate. He has like a rookie face. He's right here. No, where are you? All right. So it's clear he does not have it this time. It's clear he does not have his throwing arm this game. So we'll have to see what we can do out the backfield. Ah. Only we're just a little bit faster. Good nine-yard run, though, to start the day off. Let's keep things moving, man. We tried on through the air last time, and it didn't really work. Looks like they got a safety blitz coming off the left side. You better watch that, Carson. Oh, yeah, he's backing back up now with the motion. Oh, yeah. Come here. Let me get that first. There we go. Of course, I want to break off big runs, but it's about first downs and scoring, scoring this rock. So let's see what this Rams run defense is like. Right now, it's looking kind of softy. Hey! All right, here we go. We'll go with this curl flats. I'm going to flat second and six here. Get it to me. Get it to me. Oh, I thought I could spin on. Only reason I'm saying get that to me, right, is because we did it so many times in the uh, preseason, just spinning off guys like that and scoring. Oh, yeah, get it out. Get it out. Get it out. What happened? First down, thank goodness. I was about to say, you saw that green? I had an option route, so I got to do whatever I wanted to. And that was, oh, they're challenging me. So we at least get to see what happened to him. But I had all that green. They should have got me to rod. Ooh, that's a tough one-on-one -on -one catch. I think the feet are in. These angles are terrible, though. But there's not enough uh, proof to reverse it. This dude, Carson Wentz, is a curse. I cannot handle Carson Wentz leading this team. 32. Ah, ah, ah. Not enough for the first down. Whoa. Whoa, coach. Coach. They calling a hurry up. They said run it back. Okay, bet. Let's get this first. I'm over that line. Let's go. I can't believe they actually called a hurry up. When is the last time y'all saw uh, the computer call hurry up? Let's get it. Oh, no. What? Whoa, what was that? Why would he throw it to me? No. <laughs> Carson Wentz. All right, they want to try a counter here. We'll get one more playoff before the end of the first quarter. Ah, if 88 got his block, I might have been able to break that one tackle and get loose. All right, third and two. We'll go back high formation here. Oh, I'm cut back. There we go. Yeah, yeah. 
There we go. Enough for the first down. A huge game here. Eight for 33 today. Not too bad. All right, Lattimore is first and 10. Let's not mess this up. Go inside. Go outside. Mm, come here. Mm, come here. Come here. Get off me. Oh. Woo. At least I broke one of the tackle, tackle battles, though, but then I got cracked by Jalen Ramsey. Come on, Lattimore. Get active. Ah. You can, you can really feel how slow he is, too. Like, uh, 84 speed. It is nothing to be to laugh at. Oh, dang, I'm not in this play. All right, we were able to convert it, though. So I'll take that. I'll come up here and block. There we go. Block for my QB. I don't know if anybody was open on that one. I don't know what you're doing. Second and six. Mm, get off me. There we go. I'm trying to run like, I mean, the only option I have is to run like I'm Derrick Henry. Just not as fast. You still have yet to score points on this drive. There it is. There it is. Wide open. They try to come up with a blitz and he was butt booty naked for a second. Where's that ball? Where's that? It's picked. I know a lot of camera flippers. At least Pitt, you tried to test Jalen Ramsey one on one, didn't you? Like a dummy. Let's see. Throws it up. Back corner. I don't know why you testing one on one with Jalen Ramsey. Yo, we are really down 28 nothing right now. I might as well try to get me a couple good runs in and up up my stats a little bit. I mean, I want to pass the ball, but passing the ball ain't even been working. I'm not going to hold you. I'm trying to be fair to my teammates and let my other guys get their stats too. Carson Wentz up to like, what, four interceptions now? So I'm only going to call pass plays that I would call. And if it's not one, then we're going to run this ball. First and 10. Come here. Ah, I thought I won the tackle battle. Cool with this pass play. Just do not mess it up, Wentz. Second and six. You out here on the edge. Ah. Nobody open? All right. Third and 16 is going to take. A big play. Let me get that. It's not a first down, but he was about to get sacked anyway. Might as well go ahead and give it up to me. Is nobody really getting open right now? Like, we got Odell Beckham, Kadarius Tooney. Like, what, what are y'all boys doing? You know what? Oh, that was way too high up. I thought it was going to the slant. That's why I was. I didn't even push a button to catch it. I was not even trying to catch that rock. I thought that was really going to the slant. All right, third and four. Gotta get it out to me. No, 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 hold on to it. How is that just in between both our hands and no one's just getting full possession? So we're able to get three and get the rock back without them scoring. So I mean, I guess I'll take it. At least we're not gonna get goose egg today. There you go, good catch. Oh, right, he held on. We were moving the ball pretty well. Now it's third and five. Let's hope we can just get out of this with a... Come on. Ah, I thought I had that. I thought I had the first. Oh, coach wanted to go for it. All right, coach. Let's we'll run the same play. Yeah, Carson wins, gets set. I understand when to go for it, though. We got to go for it and for it. We're losing big. But... Oh, now you want to give me the ball. Ooh, good spin move. I've been running good routes all day. Now you want to try to give me the ball. Let's try a drop play. They keep putting this over here. Maybe it'll work. Now reception, 35 yards. Get off me. Is that Aaron Donald too? Come on now. Get off me, Donald. I am not getting tackled by some man named Donald. Third and 10. Here, let me get this block. Let me get that block. He can't even throw the rock. what it is right y'all i mean weren't able to get the dub i don't even think i had like that great of a game Wentz did terrible three interceptions only 178 yards we let him throw a lot though i mean 34 attempts 24 for 34 it's not like i was hogging the ball or anything 14 attempts for me 53 yards so cam Akers definitely had a better game there 23 yards after contact two broken tackles 
Only 3.7 to carry. I do better. We let it receptions go down for 35. He was checking down a lot. I can't help that. 22 yards after catch, too. So most of my yards was coming after the catch. He had two drops. But, you know, maybe I need to limit myself in the past game a little bit more. I was calling for some of them, but maybe I need to limit myself, not call for as much, let them throw to me and let Carson Wentz do what Carson Wentz do. And hopefully three interceptions ain't what Carson Wentz do. Okay, that's why I messed it up last time. So it automatically sims for me. That's good, that's good. Okay, we got an upgrade though after last game, which is good. And I'm definitely using this to upgrade the elusive back. Get that up to a 70 overall. Plus two spin move, plus one to his acceleration. So it's 81 excel, 84 speed. It's pretty bad. Now we got negative morale coming after that last game. I wonder, is it just because of the loss or uh, under three yards per carry? Lost on the road by over three, by over three points. So minus two to that too as well. Look, I'm not even getting. I guess I'm getting training. Okay, so it's giving me training bonus at least seven twenty seven there five nineteen. Okay, so it's at least giving me my training stuff. I'm just not able to go do it. I'll take that. But yeah, just minus two there. We lost by a lot and then minus one that carrying. I guess I got plus one for this having seven catches. So forty eight morale requires a minus one. You know, downgrade to me so we'll keep up bringing the looser back maybe get some speed upgrades in there uh but that'll be it so the, the format for the next episodes will be two games of each till we get to the end of the season uh let me know if you guys are enjoying the series and want to see more of it come out quicker we definitely will if not we'll try to get this out like once a week uh thank you guys so much for showing the love and support of the channel that you guys do leave a like and comment down below and subscribe if you are brand into the family it's me boy sgg aka the king of games me and my boy marcus will catch y'all in the next one man i'm out